What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Nerd Round. I'm Kyle the Wanderer, and on today's Card Vault series, I'm going to show you the Pokemon card from Base Set Unlimited. Number 38, Poliwhirl. So, without further ado, let's reveal the card. So there it is, the Pokemon card Poliwhirl from Base Set Unlimited. Now you can see in the top left corner of the card that this is a Stage 1 Pokemon card. Pokemon cards are the main cards used in the game to battle your opponents. Stage 1 Pokemon cards can be used when the required Pokemon depicted in the small artwork box is already in play. Poliwhirl evolves from Poliwag. To the right of the stage title, you have the title of the card, which in this case is Poliwhirl. In the top right corner of the card, you have the Pokemon's HP or hit points, which in this case is 60. Next to that, you have the symbol of the Pokemon's energy type, which in this case is water. Below that, you have the card illustration, We'll take a closer look at that in a moment. Below the illustration, you have some Pokédex data. Poliwhirl is a tadpole Pokémon. Its average length is 3 feet 4 inches. Its average weight is 44 pounds. Below the data, you have the Pokémon's attack moves or abilities. Poliwhirl's first move is Amnesia, which states, Choose one of the defending Pokemon's attacks. That Pokemon can't use that attack during your opponent's next turn. The requirement to use the attack is to Water Energy. Poliwhirl's second move is Double Slap, which states, Flip two coins. This attack does 30 damage times the number of heads. The attack does 30 times damage and the requirement to use the attack is two water and one colorless energy. Underneath the moves on the left side, you have the Pokemon's weakness, which in this case is grass. In the center, you have the Pokemon's resistance, which in this case, Poliwhirl doesn't have a resistance. On the right side, you have the Pokemon's retreat cost, which in this case is one energy. Below this, you have the Pokemon's Pokédex entry, which reads as follows. Capable of living in or out of water, when out of water, it sweats to keep its body slimy. After that, you have the featured Pokemon's current level, which in this case is level 28. Next to that, you have the Pokemon's Pokédex number, which in this case is Pokédex number 61. Down in the right corner is the card set number, which is number 38 out of 102. Next to that, you have the card rarity symbol. The diamond represents an uncommon card. To the left of the set number, you have the copyright information, which is owned by Nintendo, Creatures, and Game Freak, and the card is made by Wizards. To the left of the copyright, you have the illustration artist, this card was illustrated by Ken Sugimori. Speaking of the illustration, let's take a closer look at it now. The illustration features drawn artwork of a dark blue, circular, frog-like creature. The Poliwhirl is standing on two feet with its arms at its side. The Poliwhirl consists of a mostly round blue body with two big round eyes with large black pupils protruding from the top of its head. In between Poliwhirl's eyes are two small black slits for nostrils. Below Poliwhirl's eyes is a large white circle encompassing the center of its blue body. Inside the white circle is a long black line that swirls counterclockwise to the center. On the sides of the Poliwhirl are two short blue arms with large white gloves on its hands. Below Poliwhirl's round body are two short blue legs with toeless oval-shaped feet. Surrounding the Poliwhirl is a thin dark blue aura. 
The polywhirl is standing on a background of blue and white colors resembling that of water. And there you go. That about wraps up our up close look at the Pokemon card Poliwhirl from Base Set Unlimited. Stay tuned for the next card in this Card Vault series presented by the Nerd Realm. So, what are your thoughts on this card? And did you ever own a copy of this card? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you'd like to see more, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you can be notified when new videos are live. These simple actions will help to greatly support this channel. If you'd like to help support this channel to grow even more, visit my Patreon page at patreon.com slash thenerdrealm where you can receive exclusive benefits such as early access to videos and more. And if you'd like to get your hands on your own Pokemon cards, visit my web store, trainermerch.com, where we have thousands of Pokemon card singles and codes, and every purchase helps to directly support this channel. Check out these next videos on the screen. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep it nerdy.